Hey guys, had some fun. Back to work. Sun's starting to go down. It's still, man, the heat index is still like 99, but we got some nice shade right here. We're gonna jump back on our Yoda. See, if we can't get this girl cleaned up and get go ahead and get some of this rust spots prepped up. And let's go and get all this glass cleaned up. Not too bad in here. Not too bad in here. Uh, cab, top of the cab's practically rust free. Got a little bit of surface rust. That ain't nothing. No fix there at all. Looks pretty jam up. Mm. Got some Bluetooth speakers. If anybody wants some, free, you pay shipping. I got a pair of Bluetooth speakers there if you want them. <laughs> Lightning audio. Gotta love it. Yeah, looks like we had a pretty, pretty crappy old repair right here. Um, well, yeah, we'll get that cleaned up. It looks pretty nasty. Yeah, it's just a bad old repair. We'll get it cleaned out. Get all that trash out of there. Uh, let's see, passenger side. Yeah, it's actually a little better over here. Looks like we got a, yeah. Got a little spot there in the corner to fix, of course, right there around the cab mount to the frame. Rest of her looks pretty good. Get the surface rust off, get her primed up. Now, where our work is cut out for us, of course, which, ah, it's not gonna be that bad. We'll get her patched up good where she don't do this again. We'll go ahead and get the rest of this cleaned out real nice. And uh, I don't know, tell me what you guys think. I'm actually thinking about maybe just cleaning this out. I'm not restoring this truck by any means, but I'm thinking about just cleaning this out, getting her cut out and just doing a layover here and just doubling up on this. So it just doubles the lifespan. <laughs> Let's see, our top up here looks pretty good. Just got a little, yeah, I got one hole on this side. Let's see, we got... Let me slow down you guys don't get dizzy. Yeah, we'll get all this. We'll get all this cut out. Looks like somebody tried to throw something in there years ago. Of course, that's not going to do nothing. Yeah, we got one spot up here. Won't be too bad. Basically got to cut out about 80% of this and just redo it. Same thing down here. It's going to be fun. But yeah, um... I'll be back. Oh, we need some WD. WD-40. I think the pin on that side's busted. Door kind of lifts up a little bit, drops down a little bit when you open and close it. Yeah, but this side's fairly good, but yeah, not too bad. Hole here, trim up around this body mount. Not too bad. A little bit here, but we'll get her cleaned up. We'll be back. And we're back. Got her cleaned out pretty good. Ah, uh, man, I gotta get another flap disc. I have done war mine slap out, but we got our old uh, manual wire wheel over here. Yeah. You can see here, this is actually, um, man, that wetness is actually my sweat. Yeah, we're in the shade, but it is still humidity, guys. It's it's over it's it's over 60 percent. It's been over sixty percent, sixty percent all day. But yeah, we'll get this stuff right here. A lot of that's coming off. Yeah, we're we gonna have a bad spot right here. We're gonna have to fix here. I don't know. We might just cut this plug out because we want this interior to be to be waterproof. We actually might cut another plug hole right here. Um, we're going to have to find a way because this is prone to rust here because we do not want these cab mounts here mounted to the frame. We don't want them to hold mud. We don't want them to hold water. So we're going to figure out what we're going to do with that. But it's okay. Uh, we've hit this up pretty good here. Other side looks pretty good. And I'm actually, uh, before we get too much further, I'm going to hit this again with a pressure washer. Whew, man, look how much better that looks. I even got the, let's see how well that pressure washer trick holds up to that plastic. Yeah, I, did, I didn't hit this one with the pressure washer. 
hit that one with pretty good. That's a little old cheapo 1500 PSI. I don't need nothing fancy or nothing, but a little trick I learned with my three wheelers with this old plastic. Hit her with some good old PSI. Let her dry up. Rub her down with some WD-40. Man, she'll be spiffy, spiffy new. We'll see. Got most of her. Ah, oh, shoot, I need to hit this side. Man, this is, oh, this is a mess to get off. That headliner insulation glue. Looks like we need to get our shop back out. See, this is what I was talking about here. Look at that. It's just, it's just a little pond. And that's where your rust starts, right there. Rust, rust, you need metal, H2O, and oxygen. And you, you get rust, bud. You get rust. Look, that one over there was holding a lot. Yeah, don't worry. When we're done, um, I'm still, I still got to take this dash out. Let's see our, our roll bar up here. Looks pretty, pretty rough, too. We want to get that thing. Definitely, we don't want that thing to start rusting. That'll be structural. Um, but yeah. Man, looking good. Tell you what, I'm going to go find my, my wet vac. Probably some WD-40. I'd like to go ahead and get these ugly dog dang steps off of here. These are totally useless. And I don't think that there's like one bolt on each side holding them on. I mean, look, you can see right here, it's useless. Um, a lot of people think these are rock sliders, but these are just, these are just steps. I mean, look, look at the body damage it did right here. That's from this, of course, I mean, look at it. There's nothing, ain't nothing holding it on. Nothing holding it on. I ought to go ahead and clean up the inside of this engine too while we're here. But she's coming along. Got a lot of work ahead of us. Man, I could use a lot of input. Old Zeus. Old Zeus wants to help. Old Zeus with his floppy ears. Ain't that right, bud? We need to go for a dip in the pool. Yes, we need to go a dip in the pool. It's hot. But yeah, uh, we're going to get this dried out. Get our shop back, and then we'll go ahead and start identifying, and we'll go ahead and um, go ahead and get this prepped up. See, look, this is the old patch right here. We got to get it cleaned up, and we'll just re-weld it like it should have been from the get-go. I still need to check. Yeah, well, hell, while we're here, let's let's go ahead and look. I lay down here where it's nice and wet. Actually, still looks pretty good down here. Got a lot of water falling in my face. But that pan, that pan looks pretty good. Yeah, that pan looks pretty good. They just laid over. They just laid over. Where there wasn't any problems to try to fix. Where there was problems. But, yeah, we'll get that welded in. This looks like a lot of this is going to have to get cut out right here. Use my other hand. A lot of this is going to have to get up. Oh, you see the hole right there. We have to get that cut out, do something, get rid of that pond. Yeah, all right. All right.